All right, guys. Hey, what's happening? How you doing this evening? Man, it's about 7.30 or 19.30, uh, 100 hours, and I'm getting ready to do my power cook for the day. Well, for the night, doing my night cook. So the, the vote was pretty much loaded down except for the, uh, the fifth rack. So right now my pit is just below 50, and it's pushing out. It's not gonna be that cold tonight, so it's 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 just around I'm gonna say 40, maybe 40 degrees, 45 degrees tonight for this power cook. Uh, basic setup. As a matter of fact, I am running wide open like I always do. Okay, and then and guess what? I am using my dig my digi cube today, and uh, I got a set. If you see here, I got a set for number two, which is for ins big insulated kits. Okay, and uh, you got number one is for like Komodos and little charcoal grills, and then number three is for like offset smokers, your big offset smokers or uninsulated um, smokers. So this one is set for number two for big insulated pits like the Volt, okay, or like the, uh, the pits by JJ or uh, uh, the Stumps, one of them big ones. Okay, and then I got, I'm using my the pit bull today. Hey Derek, what's going on guys? And I have noticed if you see right here, I got it halfway open. You know, if I put it full blast, all the way open, I have noticed that my fuel burns a lot faster. So that's why I'm going halfway uh, on a draft today. Come on now. Okay, uh, just just like that, and that slows down the draft going to the pit, so I can get a longer burn. Because I do have it, I do have it loaded down, and I want to get. If I would have started at nine o'clock, it'd take it'd, it'd push me all the way to like six o'clock. So that's why I'm starting a little early today, or tonight. In the pit, let's check it out. So nothing on the bottom shelf, you know. So I'm going with. Come on out, big B. I'm going with six, six butts. I got two up top, and of course I'm cooking in pans with my racks. Okay, this is nothing but salt and pepper and a little bit of southwestern uh, sweet heat that I put on these things. And uh, I'm just gonna shred them up and make some pulled pork and some Kahlua pork, okay? If you ain't had Kahlua pork, look up the name. And man, that's some, that's some good smoke eating, okay? Then I got four big briskets. I got two on the second shelf. And I am using this, this probe from the DigiQ. You know, I don't, you don't need it, but I wanna, I'm gonna go ahead and use it see how it works out. But usually I don't run with it on. Okay, and then I got this big one though. So all these briskets are running from uh, 16 to 14 pounds, okay? And you gotta make sure, when you're cooking in pans or your brisket, hey, pull these pans up. Pull them, pull them up just a little forward so you won't get that burnt, you don't have that uh, burnt in the back, okay? So it won't cook too fast in the back. Okay, then on the third shelf, two more big ones. Well, I got a, this one's a 14 pounder, all right? And this one right here is a 15 pounder. Pull them up just a little bit. And then the last one on the fourth, on the fourth shelf. Okay. These are kind of small. I think these are 14, 15 pounds. And I'm gonna be cooking these on the fourth, the fourth rack. And guys, as always, hey, hey I'm, I'm cooking on a, uh, a a dry pit today. Okay. okay. Dry pit. I don't put no water in unless unless the thing unless this bolt gets out of control. But other than that, this, this beast this beast is loaded down except for uh, the fifth rack. Okay, let's go ahead and close this up. Let's check out the firebox. So I am going with a little bit more fuel today because I got I got some big meats in there. Come on out, baby. So today I'm actually doing. I'm doing a U-shape. Okay, I'm gonna start off with some lump charcoal so I can get it up to temp pretty, uh, pretty fast. Cause you know lump burns pretty, uh, burns hot. Okay, so that's the, the setup for tonight. And man, I'm telling you, it's gonna be quite. It's gonna be smoky. This meat's gonna be real smoky. So I'm going one, two, three, four. I'm going with six pieces of, of uh, fist size chunk woods, and it is loaded all the way to the top. Okay, because I know if I got this much meat, I got I got to put this much fuel in uh, to give me at least. Hey, Derek. Hey, man. This is gonna give me at least twelve, man. At least twelve. At least twelve hour burn. Okay. 
But I, I got to load it up this much because uh, I, I need to push through. I need to push through to about four o'clock in the morning, uh, five o'clock in the morning, because I don't want to get up. I want to sleep straight through. Okay, so back to the DigiQ. So my pit, I got my pit set for 245. All right, I'm gonna go see that. And then uh, I got that, that the one that's in the in the meat set for 171. So I'm gonna cook it all my briskets to about 165 to 170, okay? So that's set, the pit set. Let's go ahead and light this thing up so I can go to sleep. Well, I gotta get something to eat first. And then I'm gonna go to sleep. Let's light this up. And uh, hey, I'm not doing no preheat because it's not that cold tonight. I mean, if it was if it was around below 20 degrees, and I know it's going to drop uh, throughout the night uh, to about 10, you know, 15 degrees, then I would do I would add probably a half, maybe a quarter of lit charcoal, or I'll do a preheat. Okay, but I don't need to do it. But this lump charcoal is going to get it going hot and fast. Not hot and fast, but it'll get it going where it'll catch. There we go. And that lump charcoal, that's this is some mesquite that I've been mesquite that I've been using. You can already, it's already starting to pop. We'll let that go for about you know about, about a minute before I close the door up, make sure it's going good. And then uh, hey, once I close these doors up, I, I won't get up. And uh, open this thing up until it's about you know 155 internal, 160 internal. All right, I think she's going good. But I am using Kingsford today. Okay. All right, let's push this in. Oh. Down. Get in there, baby. Alright. Man, that looks good. It's smelling good too. Already. That I love that lump mesquite smell. Okay. She's good. Don't make this mistake like I did one time. I had this mug closed like that. I was wondering why my meat wasn't getting cooked, wasn't getting done. But make sure that's open. She already smoking, vents wide open. Look at this last look. I got six brisks, I got four uh, pork butts up top. I got four briskets on the second and third shelf and Two more butts on the fourth shelf. Did that. Let's see what we got. Hey, you know, you know, I got to get my locks right. Got to get my lock. You got to lock this thing up. Get in there. That's one. Lock the oven up. All right, guys, hey, that's a wrap. Yeah, I'll bring you guys back in the morning, probably about 4 o'clock, 5 o'clock in the morning. Yeah, I'm about to go eat, and I'm going to sleep. God bless, and uh, we, hey, we'll talk to you later.